So I know it's been over a week. But I want to do a quick video and I want to go over the Will Smith and Chris Rock incident, if you want to call it that. It's kind of a bizarre case because, first of all, it's celebrities and whatever, who cares about them. But there's a deeper issue that could, it, it relates to like so much of society, what's going on with society. And uh, yeah, let's so we're gonna play it and we're gonna go through it and um, yeah, we'll we'll see what happens. Who's got the hardest job tonight? Javier Bardem and his wife are both nominated. Now, if she loses, he can't win. Look at these! Look at these! Look at these uh, celebrities. All of them have millions in their bank. Look, they all got bow ties. Who the fuck? Who? Next time you go to work, you know, who the fuck's wearing a bow tie at your work? If you're wearing a bow tie in 2022, it means you fuck people over. Okay? If you're wearing a bow tie in 2022, it means you cause people's lives to go into complete ruins. So you could wear your fucking bow tie. That's, that's true. That is true. You want to debate me on it? Who the fuck do you know wears a bow tie that's a good person? Cut it out. Cut, cut the shit. Look at him laughing. Oh, she's like, I don't know. He's so funny. He is praying. He's like, yeah, yeah. She's like, I'm gonna hate I don't even love him. He's like, yeah, Chris. Get the fuck out of here, man. The most fun. You're all phony people. Look at this guy with the mask on in the background and a headset. The fuck are you doing, dude? Jesus, these guys are all cornballs. All cornballs. She fucks other men behind his back, too. Right, let's go. That Will Smith wins, like, please. Lord. <laughs> <laughs> you could see he's on, he's a like, year. Yeah. But you could see that in his eyes, I wish that I don't have the technology on my shitty computer to zoom in on his eyeballs. But you could see that he's just, there's an emptiness inside of this guy right now. There's a very... A thick emptiness inside of him. You know, I, I feel so bad for you, Will. I'm gonna take a. I'm gonna take a sip of my drink real fast. Oh man! All right, let's go. Hey, I love you, GI Jane Two. Can't wait to see it. All right. And now, Will Smith's initial initial reaction is fucking laughing, even if it's fake. You know, you got all these other people in the background's fake. But he's about to do a clap. And he clapped. He's like, because, okay, you know, this bitch has been cheating on him. Fucking his son's friends behind his back. And I'm just like manipulating him. So there's a part of him. You could see like now from the past where I was analyzing his eyes. You could see a little bit of hope in his eyes. There's like a glimmer. He's like, I've been wanting to say that to this bitch for fucking years. Thank you, Chris Rock. And right here, if you look at her, look at these demonic. She looks like a fucking evil witch, dude. Pure evil witch. With this get up too. That green demonic suit she's wearing. She's pure evil dude. Alright let's see. Boom. There it is. Look at her. Look at that. Look at that facial expression. Will's laughing. Everyone else is having a great time. Right now she's summoning the succubus. She's like summon it. Summon the succubus. That's why her eyes are rolling in the back of her fucking head. Because she's literally summoning the, de the demonic entity that's about to invade Will Smith's already already decrepit lost soul. She's like, come on. She's like putting her arms together like a witch. Cast the spell. Cast the spell of the Will Smith slap. Ah, I love nothing more than fucking a 20-year-old failed rapper behind my husband's back. Ah... My eyes are rolling into the back of my head because, oh my god, I just love 20-year-old men. Ah, I shave my head because they have alopecia. Ah, other people shave their heads, or they don't, they don't shave their heads. They get cancer and they just can't have any hair. But me in my green suit, ah, and my million-dollar net worth, ah, do something about this, Will. And that's what's about to happen. <laughs> look at, look at that, demon. She summoned the demon, and now let's see how content she is. Now she's looking like, I just summoned a demon. I just summoned the demon. 
put our arms back together. Look at that little demon ring right here. What is that? Will Smith's still laughing. <laughs> and that was Chris Rock reacting to the... De He's like, I know what happened there. I know what that happened. Was a, that was a nice one. Okay. I'm out here. Uh-oh. Richard. Oh, there he goes. Look at the walk. That's a walk like someone that's been put under some kind of possession. Within a few seconds, the demon witch got him. He got put under the spell. Here it comes. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. Will Smith just smacked the shit out of me. <laughs> there it goes. And you got all these people in the background still laughing. Like, oh, it's a joke. This is so funny. She straight up looks like that eye emoji. Whoever this woman is. I don't know who the hell she is. Her reaction is pretty funny if you pay attention to her the whole time in this video. It's pretty funny. There you go. Wow. Look at his. Look at it. Look. See the death. There's nothing in his eyes. That is a defeated man. Oh, uh, dude. Yeah. It was a G.I. Jane jump. Keep my wife's yeah, name out your fucking mouth. That's the most. That's. That should be on flags. That's like the most iconic quote of 2022 so far. A man with millions of dollars and status and all the shit he has, and he still succumbed to a fucking evil witch. I'm going to, okay? You know, and then the rest of history, Chris, okay. Chris Rock could have roasted him. That but then the whole thing ends, you know? And that is what it is. But if we still, if we go back here, if we go back here and we look, you look at this, you look at the fucking smug. Even when the joke happened, he's, everyone's laughing. She already has her lips cur curled up like, ooh, you mo fucking evil fucking person. Whoever this bitch is in the back, she's probably a feminist too. But look at this shit, dude. That shit's got to end. You know, if you're a fucking human being and you have someone like this in your life, just throw them on the street like a pile of garbage. Get rid of them. Evict them out of your lives. Treat them like hot garbage because that's what they are. And then move on with your life. But, you know, at the same time, fuck Will Smith, too, because he's not setting the right example. Fuck you, Will Smith, and fuck you, you demon. I'm out.